In Anais's swift efforts, we've been able to restore the Ancestor's DNA using the data that you sent. Thank you for your hard work. You've all done an excellent job. The Ancestor's biometric authentication data has been coded and sent to your receipt. The guide will be activated to the Ancestor's vault. There is a chance that we have not yet found the Vulgus that underwent genetic modification using Arcane. And... We haven't confirmed whether the experiment succeeded or not. But the incident in the sterile land has affected my simulations. Vargas technology is advancing faster than I expected. Almost. Unnaturally so. Jerk said he has RK abilities. <laughs> you heard me correctly, friend. You're curious about my RK, aren't you? Let me fill you in. I injected myself with the RK that I stole from you. Oh, the power flowing through my body. <laughs> what an exhilarating experience. And you were keeping all this power for yourself. I hated you so much that I could have kill you all in an instant! It appears that the genetic modification we saw earlier was successful. Now, why don't you come here and give my cold, frozen body a hug, friend? <laughs> vault is bastard. They weren't just researching ways to open the vault. Now it's clear why the Order of Truth was there. To create this monstrosity! They only wanted to retrieve the DNA. They would have sent the Legion of Immortality. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Hey, hey. <laughs> How hard did you hit this? What a brainless brute. You really want to fight me? <laughs> Commence loading. This device can force channels to change. If we destroy it, we will be able to connect to the HQ channel again. Channel reconnection confirmed. The Aceve channel is back online. Guy, please modify this code so that the channel cannot be disconnected again. I have established a defensive security code. Communications will not be affected in the future. It doesn't feel too bad to have my limbs cut off like this. I'll send you a little present soon. Don't 
usually dream. Oh, oh, oh. But thanks to the Arche Serum, I dream my every moment. You can call me Jaber. The serum that was injected into the Vulgus was from Jaber. Barnhart pulses have increased significantly. The vault must be nearby. I'll send a signal to Jeremy. Jeremy, do you read me? Jeremy. Jeremy, respond. Damn. Hang on just a little longer, everyone. It's so nice to see your face, friend. <laughs> Can you call me Jaba? Just this once. Here I am. Amon's death is in your hands, but it can't be helped. In my next dream, I'll be dancing with your call! It, haven't you? Listen. If you spotted the target, you should have said so. What are you doing here by yourself? gotten everybody so riled up. <laughs> That's it. That's what makes us the Iron Heart. It's way more impressive than what the rumors say. Hey, how long do you plan on just standing there? Go back to Albion and bring reinforcements or something. Why are you still here? Go!
just get to the point. Descendant, do you have something positive to report, finally? Where's the Ironheart now? What? I gave the order for Jeremy to retrieve the Ironheart. I never did that. There must have been a misunderstanding. Nell, did you send those instructions? I've done no such thing over any official channel, and even unofficially. I have no reason to contact him. Something's not right. Could it be? Nell, contact Jeremy. Now. I can't get through to Jeremy. His Aceive has been deactivated. And there's no record of him entering Albion either. It can't be. Jeremy is still a descendant. Even if he's sometimes led astray. He's a descendant fighting for humanity who despises the Vulgus with every fiber of his being. Alpha, we should see if we can detect Jeremy's RK and traces of the Iron Heart through the guide. All descendants on standby, please contact the guide for assistance as required. Man, identify Jeremy's last known whereabouts. Prepare for a pursuit operation. Descendant. I've heard about Jeremy, but there's something I must tell you first. When I came into contact with the energy from the second Ironheart, a new function was restored to my system. It's an algorithm for amplifying the void energy sensory field. An early warning system for detecting colossi that are drawn to the Ironheart. However, perhaps because it was transferred through Jeremy's RK, which I am not synced with, my operating system is rejecting this function. Even now, alarm bells are ringing. My functions have been interrupted and my system cannot be recalibrated. Descendant, I am in no doubt that a Colossus is heading towards Ingress at this very moment. Please transfer my sensory field amplification algorithm to Seneca. If we can intercept that Colossus and recalibrate my system, Jeremy and the Ironheart can be found. Please, help me, Descendant. It appears we have no choice. Please handle whatever the Guide needs first. As Alpha said, we cannot rely on the Guide alone. HQ will do their best to identify Jeremy's last known location and prepare for a pursuit operation. I am analyzing the Void Paradox. Descendant, is this code related to the Void? This algorithm is sophisticated enough to be applied right away. This is truly incredible. So this is the power of the guide that the Descendants have spoken of. But now is not the time to marvel at it. Based on the results calculated from the amplified sensory field, it seems a powerful colossus. The Executioner is heading toward Ingress. As you likely recall from your descendant training, the blade wielded by the Executioner is a sensitive conductor. If you allow it to power up, it will increase the time you spend in the Void. And the likelihood of failing to intercept the colossus increases exponentially. Descendant, Please proceed with the intercept immediately.
I am analyzing the Void Paradox. You succeeded in intercepting the Executioner. An extraordinary display of skill. If there was a descendant like you a century ago, I'm certain we would have been able to stop the Apocalypse. There are no what-ifs in history, of course. But the Apocalypse has left such a deep wound on humanity. Regardless, if we allow ourselves to ponder all of the what-ifs, perhaps things would be better if the Iron Hearts had never existed in this world. Every time an Iron Heart is uncovered, it's as if the Colossi are awoken and head to Ingress. But ironically, we also need the Iron Hearts to stop the Colossi. It is one of the great paradoxes. Descendant, perhaps this is exactly why the Ancestors sealed the Iron Hearts in vaults. I'm beginning to suspect that perhaps the Ancestors hid the Iron Hearts away to prevent history repeating itself. We will need extensive preparation for the moment when the third Iron Heart is revealed. Hmm. There is much that I would like to discuss with you, and also with the entity known as the Guide, if possible. However, we do not have the luxury of time right now. HQ is urgently looking for you, Descendant. You should make your way there as quickly as possible. Descendant, thanks to you, the stability of my system was restored. However, the Iron Heart has slipped from our grasp. While you were stopping the Colossus, I delivered the necessary information to Enzo. It is likely that HQ will be preparing countermeasures. Just get to the point. Ah, Descendant, you're here. Thank you for all your hard work with the Intercept battle. Unfortunately, we need to drag you into another operation before you get a chance to rest. Albion has entered uncharted territory. A descendant has committed treason. A descendant. Someone who should have been humanity's beacon of hope. Damn it! How could this have happened? HQ has officially denounced Jeremy as a traitor. A rapid arrest operation is in progress. Enzo received intel from the Guide and was first on the scene. Jeremy is heading towards Echo Swamp. As the enemy's attention is keenly focused on this location and because of the swampy terrain, deployment of forces on a large scale will be difficult. To make matters worse, we've lost contact with Esimo. He was carrying out another operation in the area. Esimo's support was vital. Enzo won't be able to command and fight by himself. Our lack of manpower is delaying the operation. If we don't hurry, we'll be delivering the Ironheart to the Vulgus on a silver platter after we worked so hard to get it. We must prevent that from happening at all costs. Rules of engagement for Jeremy will be sent separately. If possible, I would like to have him brought back alive. I want to hear what he was thinking as his commander, and why he did what he did. Go after Jeremy, and please, find the Ironheart and bring it back. I will tell Enzo to prepare to resume the operation. Understood. Descendant, wrap up any preparations for reinforcements quickly, and head to the Misty Woods outpost in Echo Swamp. Enzo is awaiting your arrival. <laughs>